come this Monday, it'll be four years, 10 months that my baby, my best friend is gone. Hurt and healing. It's not a day that goes by that I don't miss my child. And the burden of carrying on. Every day, I wait and look for my son to walk through that door. And I know he's not coming back. These are the families forever changed by violent crime in New Orleans. They robbed my treasure from me. Here, there's a common bond and a powerful purpose to find justice and to stop the killing. Ashanta Wyatt speaking on behalf of the nonprofit Mother to Mother. We must change the narrative. If we change the narrative, we change the reality because we are more. We are more than a tagline in a local newspaper slaughtered at 17 because we're trying to chase paper. We are more. We are more than chalked outlines and yellow caution tape shot multiple times because riding with him was a mistake. We are more. We are more than toe tags, body bags, and DOC numbers massacred at the hands of 15-year-old drug runners. We are more. We are more than candlelight vigils and rest in peace t-shirts committing culture genocide because we think second and shoot first. We are more. We are more. We are more. We are more. Saturday is the last night of the National Crime Victims Rights Week. The NOPD will host a resource booth at its 8th District Station. That's in the French Quarter. It's happening from 11 to 4 to coincide with French Quarter Fest. Reporting in New Orleans, I'm Jennifer Crockett, WDSU News.